Hello guys, I'm back again. So today we are here to just to uh, prepare our signature. So now that we got our little cover ready, pop this to the side and pull out our papers. So this is the part where we arrange it the way we want, want it to look. thinking of trimming these because I did trim them on the other one. Oh. Just want to trim it a little bit. <clears throat> so I want that in the center. And then we have this one, the grid and the line. So I want that in the center. And then I want to put a shorter one. And then let's see, let's see. Maybe put that bell in there, or maybe the. But I'm gonna trim this vellum too. And it doesn't fit, so I'm gonna trim a little bit at the top. It's not vellum; it's uh, tracing paper. because this is like fragile it, uh, if it's too long it's just gonna hit things and I don't want that and then this one here in the center and then I'll leave the no I'll leave one at the top <laughs> and I have this uh I need to clean that out because I want to make, um, what do you call it? I want to tuck it in, like, to do tucks. So I need to clean that out a little bit. Wait, how's the back? No, the back is fine. Well, then maybe I should just cut this one. If I can get it in there. So this one, we have the pocket going. I feel like it's, no, it's fine. I felt like it was too, okay, so I'm gonna flip it over and I'm gonna do my tuck on the back. Like that, and then this one, I'm going to do the same thing. Wait, we don't want that one next to this one. So then... This is a music sheet. Is it too... Yeah, that one's too long. So this is another one that we could tuck it in or cut it off. I'm going to tuck it in, you know. To me, the more tucks, the better. Now, um, if you want to clean that part off, you can. I'm not. I like the tearing Longest, oh, it sticks out a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna have to trim it a little bit. I was gonna say, as long as it doesn't stick out and it's stuck out. So 
I'm just, I guess I'll just clean the whole thing. <laughs> Sorry for my squeaky chair. So that there, I'll put this little one maybe on the bottom. This is an envelope that I need to make sure it's sealed because I want to open the, I'm going to put some wet glue real quick. I'm going to open the ends. Yeah, sorry guys, I didn't do my video yesterday. I wanted to uh, start the signature yesterday, but it turns out my my daughter ended up in the hospital. My other daughter with uh, she has um, diabetes, and she was in DKA, I think it's called, or going into, and. Yeah, they ended up keeping her because I guess uh, they said it was beginners. They're like, oh, no, you did go into DKA, so they kept her, which I'm waiting to hear from her. Hopefully, they release her today. Okay, that one. Oh, you know what? I want that in the... See, this one, my husband cut it in half, and um, I didn't want that cut in half, but since he did... We're going to have to work with it. So then, I'm going to pop that one there. This one there. And a little blueprint thing here. There. I'm supposed to have more than these. It's supposed to be three per kit. Um, let me get some real quick, guys. Hold on. That's the same one. Yeah, I've been uh, putting Hubby to work since he's uh, not working right now because of his injury. So I got him, you know, just holding papers for me and stuff like that. <laughs> I just can't trust him with fussy cutting, though. He's not very good at that. <laughs> oh, shoot. This one's one of the ones I had already cut. Oh, <coughs> well, we'll probably still use it. So this one could go here. But we're going to have to go back. And I'm going to add that there. That one in the center. What is this? That's just a regular. This one. Looks like that. Might have got wet, but it just shows more being more distressed. Shoot. Yeah, I'll have to trim that one a bit. out a little bit <laughs> so yeah guys have fun just you know um moving stuff around until you get it where you like it you know there's no right or wrong it's just your preference I'll just use this one since I have it right here. Or, or I have another signature here. Maybe we could steal the one from here. Put you right there. And then that one. <coughs> Excuse me. And then I got these two. I feel like I want something like colorful. <laughs> so I'm gonna search it for this one. 
And I'm going to pop that one there. And let's see. If that makes me happy. Make sure nothing sticks out. This one is sticking out a little bit. one. Where's my cover? Oh. Move this out of the way. I'm going to make sure I don't have to trim this this green one. As you can see, that's the only one that sticks out. I'm going to trim a little bit. Just so it's not like a sore thumb just sticking out out there, you know? Yeah. And it's longer too, but let's see, let's see. to look at every little thing guys I'm gonna trim a little bit too from there <laughs> you know it's gotta look uh, you know together <laughs> so um, I have to I look at every little angle just remember this is the cutting board that doesn't cut more than one page because it's old the poor thing has has worked with me for so long and I think it deserves to be left alone now so I probably won't do that much of a straight cut but I'm gonna try because I don't want to go get the other one yeah I better go get the other one okay don't go nowhere guys give me a quick second Try to run. My husband told me don't get too comfortable with it. See, I should have just brought this since I started. So apologize for that. I apologize. Put that one on the bottom. Some of these are probably good for doing little snippets so I'll pull those out later but right now video wise this one sticks out still I'm very uh well I use the word anal about things <laughs> probably not a good word to use but that's how I am. Like, ah, everything has to go according to plan. If not, it bugs me. Okay, where was this one? <sighs> Actually, no, over here. I think I'm going to switch it here so I could have a solid page to put my pockets. Yeah. So that one will go there, and then this one will go there, and I think I'm happy now. Although, ay, 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 I'm going to be here all day. I'm going to end up cutting every little thing on these pages. I'm very picky, I guess. Okay. That should be fine. So 
now this would go here but before we do that move this out of the way I want to glue my little pockets here like this one we have a this one's gonna be our little pocket I want to stitch around the whole thing and the center I'm thinking of just leaving it alone so let me move my cutting board again out of the way and I hope you guys don't mind I can't I can't put my my sewing machine like in front you know for you guys to see me so I don't maybe one day I could set something up like that because I know a lot of you have asked me in the past that you want to see me sew but yeah that's kind of a hard one for me anyways okay so I'm going to try to sew this as fast as I can so that we can get this out of the way <laughs> okay don't go nowhere guys okay talk to me I'm listening Okay, so we got that one. I don't want to take it off so I could attach the next page. So all the ones that I have, um, you know, folded this in, I'm going to stitch. This one I won't stitch all around it, just here and here to make my tuck. Okay, so I shouldn't be too long, guys. my first one as you can see I just went around it I need to cut these little pieces off so that one goes there and then let's finish this one but I need another one so this one's my next one
Okay, so this one is done. As you can see, so now what I'm going to do is put a little bit of glue on the bottom. And just to make sure my pieces don't fall out. <laughs> but they don't. I've, I've done it where I've left it alone. And it's been good. So I guess it's optional. I think that's it. Yep, that's it. Okay, so then let me take this out of the sewing machine. Get my little thread cutter thingies. So here, this is my gonna be my tuck. I'm not sure if I'm gonna leave it like that. I'll probably end up uh, collaging on there, but I am not gonna cover this because I think that's cool how you can see the numbers. Here, I mean, I like it too, but I don't know. We'll see. I kind of feel like it'll, it'll look nice if I make it decorative. Okay, so I think the sewing part, we're done with that. So now, again, I'm just gonna make sure the pages are where See, that one's in the center. That one is in the center. I don't know if I should trim. This one's making me want to fold it. <laughs> you know, just, just to be different. Just a little tuck. I know a lot of people have asked me um, what kind of sewing machine I have. To be honest, I have three. My first one that I bought was a cheapy one. The other ones were a little more expensive. But for some reason, I'm using the cheapy one. <laughs> and I have the, the Brothers JX2517. I just keep going to it. Now, if I want fancy um, stitches, then yeah, I'll go to the other one. But this one has 17 of them. But the other ones have more of a, a wider variety. But yeah, I keep coming to this one. It's just easier. It's it. It's not as delicate, I guess, is the word I'm trying to use. This one, I can do whatever, and it will nothing will be wrong with it. <laughs> so I don't know, guys. But let me do this real quick, because then I get talking too much, and then I don't do nothing. But yeah, this one I paid like. Sixty something dollars, I think it was on special a while ago, um, and I think I got it at Walmart if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, the other two, one of them is a digital one. I don't know if you guys follow Tsunami Rose, but. She has one that's where I got it from her well the idea of getting that one from her and the other one I don't know the other one to be honest I bought it and it's still in its box it was on sale when I got it but it's nice I just uh, keep saying I'm gonna bring it and give a break to this one but I don't know I just keep coming to my old one so, okay, so that one's in the center. <coughs> Excuse me. I don't know if it's my allergies, guys, or what, so I apologize if I cough here and there. Sometimes I'm just clearing my throat. But, uh, okay, so that one in the center. These are the ones that I was thinking about, all these little pieces. Um, like I think I'm going to put this one here, but now I'm debating if I want to do the pocket thing there too. Or should I leave it as is? You know what? I'm going to do the pocket again. I like my tucks. <coughs> okay. Another 
quick stitch. cut these little threads off and so that one there and I think all these are oh no wait a minute this one is the envelope I want that in the center that one I'm fine with it like that but I don't want the envelope there. I don't know if I want it on the front either. Let me find another spot. You can put it here, but I think I'm gonna put it in here better. Vellum is sticking out, or is it just me? Yeah, it's sticking out. I might have to do a little bit of a trim real quick, guys. I guess I hadn't noticed. There's the paper trim. <coughs> Excuse me. I call the vellum again, huh? Tracing paper. Okay, so I'm good there. So now, if you guys want to distress the pages, you should do that right now. I'm not. I like the way the other one I'm working on looks. So, get our cover here, and I got my little binding stuff, which I need to print a little label. I just used duct tape. <laughs> it was easy. <laughs> so, anyways, um, I'm thinking of trimming a little bit there. Where are my other? Oh, right here. I'm gonna trim just a little bit. I I like that when it sticks out. This way. But I don't want it too long either. And I can't cut straight. Sorry if you guys could hear my son. He's playing that BR thing, whatever game and like he's talking to the kids he's playing with so sometimes he gets all excited and he speaks loud I'm just trying to fray it a little bit look a little scrappy. Can't seem to cut straight, guys. Oh, <laughs> 
Excuse me. Okay, so yeah, that's the front. So then we have our signature here. Now I like to use these little clip thingies to hold it in, in place for me because I don't like to struggle. <laughs> so I'm gonna look for my center here. Again, make sure everything's the way you want it because once it's stitched, it's stitched. So then, this is going to be the tricky part. Let me put this real quick so it doesn't move since I already have it where I want it. Our spine is uh, uh, made out of fabric, so we need to find our center. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my, make sure my um, two envelopes here are together. And then I'm just going to usually just um, <coughs> uh, eyeball it but because I'm doing a video I guess I should be more professional <laughs> so I'm just gonna do a light um, line with my um, pencil here so I don't know if you guys could see it and let me make sure we're good And it won't show when our signature is put in there. So now let's make sure. Yep, it's this way. So I'm going to line it up with this journal and make sure it's centered. You got to look at the whatever you have left here and down there. So I always just try to make it even. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the clips on the actual uh, cover now. Because I don't want to do the whole ruler measuring. I, I used to always do it like that. But then it's like, you know, this is so much easier. So that's that. So then if I close it, just making sure. Okay. So then we're going to grab our needle. And get this ready put that there and um, maybe no I got this set at um, Amazon I just can't remember how much but it came with all the gadgets it's too that one too okay, I'm gonna go for the <laughs> I want to say this one and then this one's calling me <sighs> I should do the my mother your mother <laughs> okay I'm gonna go for the first one I picked yeah I'm not gonna think about it because we'll be here all day so Find the end to this. And these are the ones that are have the wax. Okay, do you guys see it? Because I don't. <laughs> Maybe this is a sign I'm supposed to use the other one, huh? Oh my goodness, where is it? Okay, if the other one is easier, the other one wins. See, look at this, look at this. Sorry, dude, you lost, not cooperating. So, what happened here? Now you're giving me attitude?
for some strange reason, it got stuck. So is this a sign I'm not supposed to use this one? Oh my goodness. Okay, let's go back to the other one because I think uh, that one's driving me nuts already. Scan the premises. Scan the premises. And next time I'm going to make sure I do this first before I turn on the camera. Apologize, guys. My little thread here seems to have issues with me today. I don't see it, guys. I just don't see it. And I'm trying to run my finger and see if it comes out, and it's not coming out. Every piece I think it is, it's not. This is unbelievable. I think my whole hour is going to go here. Okay, let's go back to this one. Oh. I think I cut it off. Yeah, I'm not sure what happened with that. I'm just going to throw that to the side over there. So... If you guys have seen the pamphlet pamphlet stitch um, tutorials that are out there, I know there's a lot. I just cut it enough the the length three times, and um, and that's it. <laughs> that's all you need. So now I'm gonna come back to this. Make sure, and I don't think I'm sure. Hold on. there now let me turn this around oh, sorry guys I have to um, point it towards me okay right there okay I think I have it right no I don't look at that oh yeah yeah Learn from my mistakes, guys. <laughs> Don't do what I do. Okay. Okay, I think I'm good. So then I'm going to get my little pokey tool. These also came with the little kit. I'm going to eyeball it. It's just one in the center and two on each side. I'm going to eyeball it and just press all the way till it comes out. And I usually just a little bit to give me some uh, space. I try to go here about maybe half an inch to a quarter. No, no, not to a quarter half an inch I think a quarter would be too little not enough so then there and just push it in just then we get our needle this is what we decide do we want the tying thing on the inside or on the outside this time I want it on the outside because I'm probably going to cover it so I'm going to start from the back do this and I'm not succeeding from there to there 
So then I'm gonna pull it and then it, it doesn't matter either up or down. I just go with whatever my hand decides. <laughs> Pop it in there, pull it. You wanna make sure you leave a little tail if you wanna hang things from it. I normally cut it off and cover it with lace or something because I don't really like to do dangles and stuff like that. I love them, I just don't like to make them. For some reason, I always mess up my nails and even though I have the tools and stuff, I always end up using my fingers and next thing you know, my nails look all crappy. So, okay, and then this thread needs to be on one side and then this one in the middle. So I'm gonna pull them both out. I mean, not out, pull them to the side. And then pull it, take off our, our needle. We'll make sure nothing's loose, which it doesn't appear to be. And pull, but don't pull too hard because you don't want to tear it. Keep in mind this paper. And I'm going to do, I usually do three knots. You know, I'm always doing threes. You guys follow me. Mm. And I'm just going to use my scissors to kind of press it down. Now, um, for now, I'm going to leave it even. But knowing me, it's going to get covered. <coughs> <coughs> oh my goodness. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Get some water real quick. <coughs> Only happens in camera. <sighs> Fucking allergies, man. Okay, so then we are done, guys. I'm just pressing. Nothing's sticking out, so I think we did good. So there is our little journal already put together and everything, guys. Sorry, that's my phone. Put this back before I lose my little needle. Pop that to the side over there. Yeah, this is not gonna be good for me. I don't like hanging stuff. But for now, I'm gonna try to leave it there. Where are we in time? We're 43. Okay, so then I guess uh, since we put the signature in, we got our papers together, I'm going to stop the video because we don't have a lot of time. On the next video, I think we're going to start, um, I want to cover some of these pages, like the one I'm working on. And see like here, this is, I love this kit. I have to look it up and see who it belongs to, but a lot of those pages I just incorporated in here and see look at that beautiful i have to look because i know some of you guys are going to ask because it's nice <clears throat> but um <coughs> excuse me as you could see i left it here blank because you got some nice space there for journaling here it's not so much i wanted to cover the page i just want some pages to look um <clears throat> you know pretty here again Oh, this is one of my pockets that I was doing with the kit. I was, it should have been for that, but I popped them over here. So I did a little bit of collaging with the paper. Isn't that cute? I like that pocket. Anyways, <laughs> so yeah, I, um, so we're gonna be doing this um, matting, I guess is what we would call it. <clears throat> so then that's all for today, guys. I am gonna do a quick video because I have some sharing to do. And then um, I will continue with the matting of the pages. But for now, this is it. We got our journal all put together and done. Sucker's not going nowhere. So yeah, we're good, guys. So I will see you guys in part three. Um, other than that, thank you so much for watching, guys. I really enjoy you guys being here with me doing this project. And uh, oh, for those of you that asked, I went ahead and added a couple more of the kits um, 
and that's gonna be it I don't have any more to make them the same yeah I don't have any more so I was only able to do I think it was four of them so that those are the last ones that I could do other than that um, who knows maybe we'll do a kit with uh, you know different items and put it together other than that, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. You guys take care. God bless. Bye.